So we're here at the Bodega in Nottingham um, celebrating the Hockley Food and Drink Challenge which has been an event run by City of Football over the duration of the Euro Championships this year. Um, basically it involves 24 venues in Hockley each being designated a country and each of those venues have kind of made a dish or a snack or a drink or a cocktail that best represents that country and has had it on sale for the duration of the football championships and today we're celebrating all those and bringing them all together and having a little look at the kind of diverse range of cultural food. Bodega every year, as, as every time the, either the Euros or the World Cup has been on, we've, we've shown the football anyway, we're all big fans of the football here and we actually get quite a big crowd down, so when City of Football spoke to us about taking part in this, we jumped at the offer. Everyone's made such an effort in the dishes they've provided and because everyone's in a different dish from a different country that are in the Euros, it just it's just a nicer feel, everyone's putting a lot of effort and it's nice to try that and see, see it all here today. We're a Caribbean tapas restaurant and also do classic cocktails. We've got over 100 rums. Um, we've been around for about two years. And today we bought, we, we're given Poland as a country, so we bought Polish dumplings but with a Caribbean twist. We're a small independent cafe bar. So by day, a cafe that serves brunch. By the evening, we're a bar with live music. Um, our dish represents France, and we decided to go with a baked camembert, which is one of their, France's most famous dishes. I think food is something that everybody can relate to. Everybody enjoys food, um, and it's just something that really unites people. You know, I think what this event has done is, is opened that up and shown people that there are more countries out there and there is a more extensive, you know, palette of European food to try. It's, it's great for people to, to see what else is available and what else is out there. I think Nottingham's really good at collaboration. We see that through events throughout the year. Hockley Hustle, for example, where it's all about bringing people together. It's not about money, it's about celebration. Um, and this event has been brilliant for that. All the venues straight away wanted to get involved. We're really keen to all kind of celebrate together. Um, I think collaboration is a massively important thing in terms of moving forward. It's good for people to find out who the independent businesses are because most people do want to support that if possible. So that's what Hockney is about is independence, it's supporting the independence. Uh, we all support each other, we help each other, we, we're friends with each other and uh, that's what Hockney is about, it's the heart of Hockney. The atmosphere when there's a football match on, when the country is feeling kind of proud to support their country is when there's food involved as well, I think it makes the atmosphere a lot better. Once you've got sport, football and a drink among friends, you've got everything you need really. I think football is a universal thing. There's lots of people that are interested in football, watching football, getting involved in the big competitions that happen. Um, what City of Football are trying to do is engage those that might not have already been engaged in football through different events like celebrating the cultural side of things um, and actually people therefore being involved in football but not necessarily directly kicking a ball.